Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear. Yeah, I'll leave it loud and clear. That's probably the loud and clear. One, one, one. That's you. One, 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 one. That's a bit better. That's good. Yep, I can hear. All right. Let's listen to our ATIS. ATIS is one, one, eight. Uh, so it's, yeah, it's up in here. So change it. Oh, that, that. This is the number two radio. So. This is number one, but once you set that... So, so that this number is two? number one? No, that's number two. Uh, this is it? number two. Yep. So 1147, that's our ATIS, right? Yep. Yep, that's our ATIS. This one's better than 5005. Temperature 242.17, temperature 3002. Cruiser approach in use, landing part runway 17. Advise initial contact, you have information CR. Here. Current prioritize information and CR, time one six five zero zero. wind one two zero at seven sky conditions better than five thousand five. Temperature two four two point one seven or temperature three zero zero two. Cruiser approach in use, landing part runway one seven, advise initial contact you have information CR. Here's the two point two four temperature two four. Current prioritize information and CR, time one six five zero zero. wind one two zero at seven sky conditions better than five thousand five. Temperature two four two point one seven or temperature three zero zero two. Cruise okay. approach in use. All right. So I have winds one two zero at seven, better than five thousand twenty four on the temperature, seventeen on dew point, three zero zero two on altimeter, and runway use one seven. Okay. Um, we have. Where am I at? Okay, avionics on, ATIS, we did that, altimeter, 3002, right there, yep, kind of, okay, and our transponder, this one, oh, this one here, yep. what's this, that's the that's autopilot, the autopilot? Yep. okay, so we are on out and 1200, perfect, okay, uh, ADSB on. System five six five zero. Nav. Frequency change approved. See you later. And our radio test. So on this one, you said the this one. Oh. Yeah. So we click on it if you want to. That's to swap them around. Okay. For the one that's on standby, you can click and punch it in. It's all touch screen. Oh, it's like. So this will be for our ground. So ground frequency. I think it's 12115, 12115. Yep. Then go enter. Oh, there you go. that's cool. And then to change it over, you just press the top one. It switches. Okay. Uh, or if you don't want to do the touch, you can still just use the old way. Just the big knobs, change the big numbers uh, knob to the little numbers. There cool. You go. All right. So we need to have that on 12855. Actually, oh, sorry, I'll <laughs> There you go. There you go. Alright. So we have that. Um, how do we test it? We just pull it or... Pull this one. Did it pull this? No, push the squat. <laughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> okay. Now we're gonna give them a call, right? Yep. So I'm gonna say Grand Prix Ground Cessna uh, three five five zero two at Skyway ramp, uh, ready for taxi for departure south with information here. Okay. Grand Prix Ground Cessna five two five three five five zero two at Skyway ramp, ready to taxi for departure south with information Sierra. 35502, Grand Prix Ground, runway 17, Taxi VL. Taxi VL, 35502. And you okay. forget your flaps on your checklist as well. That's still down. Down here. Flaps up. Oh, okay. My bad then. 
No, I didn't do this one. Heat and yeah. Okay. Okay. Everything else looks good. All right. Test the brakes. Uh huh. Nobody around. Did you say three five via alpha? Yeah. But you said one seven. No taxi via alpha. That's what the three said. three five. Only one seven. You, wanna, you want me to give him a call? Yeah, just say Grand Prix Grand confirm on my 35 or 17. Grand Prix Ground uh, says now 35502. Can you confirm uh, runway 17 or 35? Runway 17 and Sierra is current. Sierra is current, runway 35. Uh, 17. Got it, thank you, sir. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure you said 35 and you confused the hell out of me. Alright, let's go. Okay. Unless he said it as well, I'm not. It's either you or him, but I said 3 5 and it was yeah. confusing. I'll test my brakes. Your controls? Alright, that's good. Okay. Grand Prix Ground, Skyhawk 52980 with Sierra Skymates, Ray Taxi. 52980, Grand Prix Ground, runway 17, Taxi Alpha. 170 Alpha, 52980. Military guys. What's that? Military guys. Oh, military guys. Okay, so we're gonna take this corner right here, the, the closest. I'm gonna do a U-turn. Yep, just turn right and then yep. to the run-up area. Okay. Let me adjust this because I don't like it. All right. Or run up. Brakes. We know they're good. Fuel on board. Train for takeoff. Flight controls. Up, down, rudder, left, right. Okay. All good. Initiation lights. All good. Instruments. A little bit tilted. Okay. Altimeter. Vertical. BSI indicates good. We just adjusted the HSI. All good. 1800 RPMs. The test or Mac. Okay. First left. 100. Back to ball. Right. 100. Back to ball. Go to idle. Oop. Idle a little, a little bit crooked. Are we good on that? Okay. All right. Oh, and we supposed to do our. Okay. So oil pressure, temperature is good. Vacuum on green. 
Um, all good, two flow, and 28 on the hold. Runway 175, All good on the Back to idle. And our throttle friction. Yeah, just bring it back to 1,000. What's that? Let's bring it back to 1,000. Okay. There we go. All right. So pre takeoff, flaps, make sure best power, auxiliary pump off, um, transponder on 1200 alt, heading bug. We have our wind on 120. So we're gonna be on there. Doors and windows yeah, locked. We can okay. Set our windows and we hold short. Landing light on, taxi and strobe. Okay. That's pretty much it. Time and brakes released. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm gonna say uh, first we need to change it to Just ground. I know. Tap it. Tap the top one. There we go. Oh, okay. So it's not doing. Okay. So Grand Prix Tower says now five uh, three five five zero two. I don't know why I have <laughs> five today, like Sierra the other day. So Grand Prix Tower says now three five five zero two zero 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 three five five zero two. Um, Holding short runway one seven for departure south. Yep. Okay. Grand Prairie Tower says now three five five zero two. Holding short runway one seven for departure south. Says so three five five zero two Grand Prairie Tower runway one seven. Clear for takeoff south. Clear for takeoff three five five zero two. Yep. Shut your window before we move. Yep. Okay. Let's go. Says so three five five zero two runway one seven. Clear for takeoff south. Take out 35502. 708 kilo, kilo frequency change of Frequency change for kilo kilo. Must have not heard us. I said it, right? Yeah. Okay. Oops, wait till you center line. Hey, take off. Okay, remember the wind's out to our left. Yep. There we go. Speed's alive. 50. 55, rotate. Nice. This thing is blowing in my... This is 2479 mic, holding short, runway 17 alpha, ready for takeoff. That's blowing in your face, is it? Yep. That's 2479 mic, runway 17. My eyebrows were like going... Did you want to adjust it? No, I'm good. I'm good. Okay. I already did it. All right. So let's see our climb, power, make sure instrument stacks and light off. Okay. Power looks good. Yep. Instruments look good. All right. We're good on that. Where, where are we going? Where are we going, sir? So climb to two five and just continue south. Just the two five area. Long thing is south. Okay. Just turn left a little bit more. There we go. Hold that heading. Okay. Otherwise the wind's blowing One six zero. Yeah, that'll do. Yep. Two thousand five hundred. Yep. Okay.
Tower 7781 Sierra Papa, holding short at one eight one seven southbound VFR with Sierra. Cessna 781 Sierra Papa, Grand Prix Tower, runway 17, quick take out south. Quick take out south, approved. Cessna 781 Sierra Papa, thank you. Still have that heat. Yeah. It's not that bad. Got six miles traffic. This gives you traffic as well. Grand Prairie Towers down. Five cool. Nine eight zero holding short of one seven. Yeah, yeah there. Three five five zero two frequency change approved. Three frequency change approved. Three five five zero two. Okay. Uh, one this two three. Our mic traffic ahead into your left half mile southbound Cessna two thousand three hundred. Looking for that traffic. Seven nine mic. Thank you. Cessna five two nine eight Sierra. Follow the Cessna point clear for takeoff runway one seven south. Okay. Two thousand five hundred. Twenty two hundred RPM. Uh, it's one two three three zero, right? Oh, we have the traffic site. There it is. Okay. Maintain this heading. Yep. Yep. All right. My controls for a little bit. I'll just Your talk control. about what we're doing. So, with the engine out, once we get into the training area, I'm going to be cutting the engine off by just simulating power out. Okay. Okay. So what we want to do, we want to do that A, B, C, D, E. Okay. So A is airspeed, so best glide, which is? 68. 68, okay. So we, once we lose our engine, it's pitch for 68 as soon as we can, okay? Okay. Then B is best field. So choose the field. What, what would be the most ideal field? Um, airport. Airport, but... yeah. So we look all around the areas for our options. We don't just... You know, immediately pick something because we're also looking at the hazards, power lines, you know, the terrain as well. Because if, if we're if we've got some altitude we got we got time to make our decision, okay? Okay. And so once we've picked our best field that doesn't have any hazards like you know power lines, trees, cattle, um, the terrain's good. And also with we're taking in into, into consideration as well with the wind direction. So ideally, we want to be facing into the wind as well. Yep. Okay, so where's the wind coming from today? Uh, aloft, it's uh, 135 at 14. Okay. At 3,000 feet. Yep. So like southeasterly, okay? Southeast, yeah. So ideally, yeah, we'd, we'd like to, the best field would have an open area, no power lines, no trees, flat terrain, and into the wind, or an airport, that's something like that. Okay. Okay? Got it. So we're thinking about that as we're choosing our best field. But we try and, you know, not take up too much time, you know, try and do that with some haste as well. Then, after we've selected our best field, and we're going to go through our checklist, okay? So pulling out our checklist over here. The first one is power loss in flight. So just read through that. Okay, What's that's that like 68, yep. north so wind direction and velocity. You said that, so let's land check. landing site. And we've done that. So those, okay. those first three things, we've done that before we've got to our checklist, okay? Okay. So they're almost memory items. And yep. then, then we're checking our fuel to the engine because it could be just be a simple, you know, we've, we've got, you know, our, say the right selected, We've burnt out fuel on the right. It could just be that. It could just okay. be a mistake on our behalf that we've just burnt out our fuel on our right. We can switch it to the left or back to both, and then the engine will come alive again. So now we're just checking. We're going through to make sure everything's set up, that fuel is flowing to that engine Okay. for a restart. So fuel shutoff valve on. Yep, so we're making sure in. that's in. Fuel selector check, switch on board. Yep, which we did. Yep, yep so check and both. We do our uh, auxiliary so. fuel pump switch on. We just there. simulate turning that on. Yep. Okay, what else? And make sure full reach. Magnetos check all and master on. Yep. Yep, so all that is just making sure the engine is getting fuel to it. Okay? Yep. Because it'd be pretty embarrassing if 
we had the you know the right selected or we we pulled the mixture out too far and declared an emergency and we've got lots of fuel on board yeah. okay so yeah. that's why we, that's why they want you to check that all right sure. so once once we've established everything's good and we still don't have engine start then we're going to this checklist here no restart and if time permits okay now we're going to set up the aircraft for an emergency landing that involves declaring uh, so declaring emergency which would be squawking 7700 which is our emergency squawk okay then we declare emergency so our last atc frequency our guard frequency 121.5 1 okay and they they direct us give us some help if we if we need it okay yeah. So, so, we, either, so we, we could switch. switch, yeah, it's either your last frequency you're talking to, so because we're just south of uh, Grand Prairie, we can call them to clear an emergency if they'd send out help, okay? Or if we don't know where we are and we couldn't get, get a hold of our last frequency, we go to guard frequency, which every ATC tower listens to, which is 121.5, 1. 1. 1. okay? Okay. After we've done that... We mixed your full lean. Now we're now we're cutting off all the fuel to our engine because in case we have a heavy landing, we don't then want to create a spark and then have a fire. you know must big fire when we land. Okay, so we're starting to cut off fuel. So mixture if we go full lean, we put the shut off fuel off. Okay. Tighten our seat belts and harness. Yep. And then flaps, flaps as needed. needed. Pull okay. flaps when fuel assured. Then master and max off. Huh? 65 knots with full flaps. Yep, so basically we're just setting up for our landing just as we would on final. We'd have our speed set, our flaps as needed. Once that happens, we'd unlatch the door because if we have a heavy, heavy landing and we still get our doors latched, then they could squash and we wouldn't be able to get out, okay? So we unlatch the doors just on final. Okay. And then protect body. Yep. That could be a, a bag. If, if you've got like a seat cushion, just something just to brace Okay. For impact, okay? Yes, sir. So that's what we're going to be going through. Okay. Any questions of that? No. All no. right. So your controls take us up to 3,500. My control. Top practice area, Cessna 2479 or Mike. We're about two miles to the east of the South Tip of Joe Pool Lake at 2,500. We're headed 170 heading towards Mid Lothian. Area. Got one on the right and one on the two of them on the back. Okay. On the tail and then oh my god, three of them in the front. <laughs> See them? But uh, they are far. Yeah, yeah. Like six miles, seven miles. Yeah, we'll just maintain okay. this heading. Three thousand five hundred set. Okay. Right, sir. Traffic 3502, 3500, three miles to the east of Venus, uh, southbound, right, sir. Okay, 3500. Yep. Got you inside. Got you inside. You're right below for about 11 o'clock, high. Lovely. All right, next. That is right below us. I don't see anyone. Not even coming out either. Oh, so there's a little gliding distance, is it? I think so. Yeah. Well, I have traffic, so it's not from... We can see the other traffic. I'll turn more to the south. Oh, about that. So just that. A little bit. Just your heading indicator. Top Pakistan area, Cessna 2479 Mike over Miss Lothian at 3000. Headed 170, and uh, we're going to be holding here at 3000 to the west of uh, Midlothian. Okay. 
Mark Sirius, 781 Sierra Papa, over the 287 interchange, 2500, climbing 3500 southbound, South Park Sierra. That's good. All right. Okay. So I just put that there, just in case. So we're gonna do some clearing turns first. Okay. First left. Yep. Okay. Stop right there. Traffic down to 20 kilos. So about two and a half to the west of Lake Waxahachie, 6,500. Engine out, Billy. Taken on the right. Yeah. Back pressure. Back to south. Yep. Okay. Twenty two hundred RPM. A little climb. Three thousand five hundred. Okay. Clear traffic. All right, good. That's what we're gonna do. So let's say lost my engine right now. So power's out. I pitch for success. So my controls. Your control. I bring the nose up. Speed washes off, and then I trim. Okay. So sixty-eight. So we're set there. So now next is the best field. Okay. So looking around, so we got nice greenery all around us, nice and flat. Yep. Even over to the left here, what do we got over there? Uh, those are the crop fields. Oh, look a little bit further left. What's that? Over the left. It's over to that east there. What's that long, skinny black? See that where the hangers are? There's an airport right there. See that? Okay. Just here. Oh, this one here. Right, yeah, right there. Okay. Yeah. Yep. So instead of landing in a field, we can go land on that, can we? We can, yep. yep. Actually, we have... Okay, yeah, we so have we, got our, we got our field. Got we're our field. pitching for 68. So we're nice and close to it. We'd be able to make that quite easy. Yep. So now we keep that in sight the whole time. Now run through our checklist. Okay, fuel, fall, fuel uh, shut up valve on. Yep, so make okay. sure that's in, fuel shut-off yep. valve on. And then fuel selector check on, on both. Okay, make sure that's on so both. Both, auxiliary pump off. Okay. Power punch, uh, switch on. On, okay. Okay, yep. make sure on. And... Key belts, harness, flaps as needed, Ma Oh, no. no, 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 no. So yeah, make sure fuel magne right. magnetos one. check all. Yep. Are we just five, checking five, the magnetos yeah. now? Yeah, so we're just making sure so they're five, prop five, would five, stop, five, okay? Five, so we're just making sure that we can get a restart to engine. If that doesn't happen, now we go into this. If no restart, all right? Oh, okay. No restart. So I'm maintaining less wide speed. I'm punching in 7,700, declaring an emergency. Now mixture full lean, so I bring a mixture full lean. Then fuel shut off is off, seat belts are on, and then flaps is needed. So the next one will be flaps. Once I have my flaps in, I'll be master off, and then unlatch doors and protect body, okay? Okay. So we've gone through all steps. We've picked our best glide. We've checked the best field. We've gone through our checklist. Okay, we couldn't restart, so now we've set up for an emergency. We've declared. All right, and now yeah. we're going to execute our landing. All right, so I've okay. still got the master switch on. So far, Skyhawk 5290 Sierra, two miles northwest of TSA, 3000, climbing to four. So we're going to bring in one set of flaps, start slowing down, and if we're too too high, 
What can we do? We can do a forward slip. Yeah, we can just bring a forward slip in. Alright, I'm going to recover at 900 feet. So I bring in my further flaps. Start to slow down like normal. And we'd be online for a to make that field only. Yes, okay. sir. Alright, so we've made the field 900 feet, so that's full power. Flaps up. Take that trim out. Next notch of flaps. Alright, and now it's just a normal go around. Okay. Yep. Yep, and the remainder flaps. Any questions with that? No. Nope. Okay. Hope I remember everything. Yeah, just make sure like we take our time with the checklist, okay? Because a lot of students, as soon as that engine is cut off, they want to rush through it. And by rushing yeah. through it, you miss steps quite easily. Yeah. Okay? See and always, always remember, we're flying the aircraft first, so don't get too fixated on just reading out the checklist, okay? And not watching your airspeed or remembering where that best field was, okay? Okay. So we got to keep that all... All in tight. So we do a couple lines, look up, continue flying the aircraft. Okay, still got my field in sight, back in, checking, run through a few. Okay, I don't want you just sitting there, head down, reading it off the whole time and forget to fly the aircraft. Yep. All right. So maintain this heading here and then climb to 3000. 3,000. 3,500 actually. Okay. Alright, Sierra, traffic 35502, 2,000 feet, uh, one mile to the west, TSA, southwest bound, climbing to Someone right in front of us. Go right. Oh, yes, yes. Uh, he's he's coming. coming, he's coming. Yep. He saw us. South Rock, Jerry Scott, 5090, 4000 over May Pearl, maneuvering. Okay, 3500 still? Yep. Okay. Traffic, 2 o'clock, low, less than 1 mile. Zero 09. It's yeah, underneath us. He's yeah. going down. 781 Sierra Papa. Turn to the right. Oh yeah, he's coming right underneath us. Yep, yep, yep. One in our, on our tail at same same altitude, three five five two. Yeah, he's coming. Yeah, 
drop. I get oh, why is it say three five five oh two when we are three five five oh two? You see this one here? <laughs> I think that was us, is this you lagging? I don't know. Is it? And now it's gone away. Oh okay. Yeah, that's three thousand five hundred? Yep. Let's see this. So you just lost your engine. What's lost first? Engine. First glide. Okay, 50 for 68. 68. Up. Yeah. Trim that aircraft so you don't have to be worrying about it. Alright. Now we're on 68. What are we looking for now? Okay, we're looking for a best field. Okay. Oh, let's see. In air, airport. In airport. Uh, we have one right underneath us. I can see it. Huh? We are crossing an airport right now. Is this one here? All right, private. Okay. I maintain 68. Uh, that one. We probably cannot make that one. Um, Which one? This, this, it says here one underneath. Yes, directly below us. Direct, yeah. So you can do some 360s, you can fly out, fly back in. But that ideally, would be a good one. Ideally, we want to, you know, what we always do for a, a landing is fly a downwind at base to final. Ideally, we want to do that because that's our best judgment for okay. distance. We can, okay. We can actually extend our downwind and then come into okay. it, but uh, I don't know. Let's, the, give it a, let's give it a go. Okay. All right. What so else? This, so this we've, is we've it's checked. actually that, that's a that's a grass grass uh, land strip. That's land. fine. Okay. So we have our best field. We can actually make this one. We can make it work. Okay. Uh, what else? And um, keep that best glide. What else are we going through now? Um, best glide. Don't let that nose come down too much. Okay. The faster you are, the faster we go down. Okay. Okay. What else? The next one, let me check. Big land inside and then we go through our checklist. Okay. This fuel shut off valve on. It's on. Fuel selector on both. It's on both. Okay. Where's that field? Yeah. I'm gonna start turning. Okay. What else? Auxiliary pump switch on. on. Alright. Okay. And make sure full reach. Alright. Magneto check and master on. Okay, master yeah. it's on and magnetos. We're not gonna do that right now, right? Okay. Alright, what so else? I'm almost a beam to it. Okay, so if no restart, yep, the we'll still maintain. The engine didn't start. And we are too fast. And then maintain base glide, which I'm trying to do right now. Yep. And also trying to make the field. What else is on that check? Squawk. We need to declare emergency. Squawk 7700. And then okay. we change to 121.5. And we're declaring an emergency. All right. We're so a bit our high. Speed? Yeah, so we're a bit high and fast, okay? Okay. So you started turning in a little bit early. We can bring our flaps in to slow down. Okay. This is, yep, forward slip. Keep forward slipping. Okay. All right, let's level out and recover Number here, okay? Okay. okay? Let's, let's recover. Sierra is one mile east of Maypearl, 4,000. It's going to be descending down to 3,000. Yeah, watch that nice. There we go. Bring that flaps out. All right, not bad for your first one. Faster. Got to be faster on that. So when we turned onto the final, just you noticed straight away that we were a bit too, a bit too high and a bit too fast, okay? Yeah. So the two tricks we have is our forward slip to get, lose that altitude, and the flaps are going to help us slow down, okay? Ah, I forgot the flaps. Yep. So, if we bring in our flaps too early as well, we got traffic. 
Uh, that's a heli. heli? Yeah. yeah, that's a heli. So if we've picked a field and and we're going to be landing into the wind, be very cautious of when you bring in those flaps, okay? Because okay. if you bring in those flaps too early, and then by the time you turn onto the final for that field, you'll slow down dramatically and you may not be able to glide to that airport, yeah. okay? That's right. So always keep that in mind I with the flaps. But if we're not directly into the wind, we could probably bring in, if you know the, like then, our field wasn't too far away, we probably could have brought in 10 degrees of flaps. And, and then it slow, slow, started to slow down just gradually as we get into the final. Then you're making that judgment, seeing how that aircraft is reacting as we're on that final, okay? okay. But no, that was, that was good. You had good judgment there to circle around and, and get on that final. So I was very happy with that. With uh, the checklist, Maybe bring it up, so instead of keeping it on your lap, so where you, it's very hard sometimes to look down and, and look, keep looking I'm, back up. I'm going to get one of those clips. You can get a clip here, or you can hold it with your hand. Okay. All right. Oh. And then go, th and then it's there. Then, so you're still, I... you're still looking out up, you're flying, and it's right in front of you, okay? So then you're not bringing your head down, that's how you get a little bit disoriented. Yeah, yeah, and it gets hard to fly. As well. yeah. Let's keep this heading and we'll climb to 3,500 again. 3,500, okay. Yeah. yeah, some aircraft have a clip that clips just here. Yeah, I'm going to, they have it for sale, I'll, I'll, I'll yeah. buy that one. But alternatively, yeah. while we don't have that, just True. use your hand and just hold it there, okay? Yes, sir. Um... Yeah, so what I want you to do tonight is just read through this and try and memorize, like, at least half the list Yeah. so we know what we have to check, all right? And have, okay. a, have a flow, because this sort of flows, all right? So with the fuel shut off, you, all we're doing, all this first check is checking mostly all fuel, okay? Okay. So, you, so down here you got fuel shut off and fuel selector are both next to each other. Yep. Then we come up, mixture. We then go across, fuel pump, okay? Yep. All right, and then it's magnetos, which is next to that, and That's master it. on, which is all. So we can go here, up, to the left, all right? Got it. Yes, sir. And that will save you if you're starting over there and coming back and going over true, here, True, okay? true, true, true. Yep. It's a nice flow. Yep. Because that will take seconds to check and you'll notice something out of the ordinary straight away. And then we can restart the engine, hopefully, and then be on the way. If yep. not, remember, once the once we've checked that the engine won't restart, we're then doing a transponder, declaring emergency. Okay, and then starting to take the fuel away from the aircraft, which is fuel shut off, mixture out. Okay, and then flaps as needed, then master off on final. Okay. Yep. All right. So once we're at 3,500 nearly, okay. let's uh, we'll start flying to the east. east. Okay. Yep. Almost there. Are you right? We're right. We'll do a roll out in this heading. Okay. That's our east. Next area traffic 35502 is 3500, one mile to the southeast of Lake Alvarado, eastbound. Next area. Give it another go. Bring that out. Okay. What's first? First we set up for the glide, best glide. Okay. 
up, so bring that nose up, set that speed, and then trim. Okay. What else? Let me let me make sure I have the. Right yeah, use your tr use your yoke to set yep, that okay, pitch. Okay. Yeah, if you if you if you leave it there and then just do that, it's not really doing anything. Okay. Okay. Set your pitch first, then your trim. Okay. Okay. All right. Now we're there. What else? All right. Best field. Okay. We're looking here. We have one. We have one right on our left. Trying to see where it is. Kind of far. Yeah, a little bit far. Okay. All right. Well, what else we got? Nothing here. We have one directly north. What about that big field over here? Look how open and flat that is. Okay. Okay. Or okay, we All can right. we can pick that. Which one are you referring to? This big brown area. See how big flat front. and wide and okay. It's like a gigantic runway. Okay, we can make that. So that's good. That's that's our that's gonna be our landing. Okay, side. what else now? Okay, now we are doing our flow, right? Okay. So our flow. Fuel shut off and fuel on uh, on board. Okay. Okay, make sure I maintain best glide. Delta X here, uh, and then, uh, Alpha Venus at 3000, climbing. Yeah, if you forget, just refer to your checklist. Yep. Uh, auxiliary, uh, make sure full reach. Okay. Okay. And then, uh, we go to our, um, fuel pump. We fuel pump on, make sure full reach, magnetos to check, both right. of them, and we should make sure master it's on, and right. maintaining our 68. The engine didn't okay. start. The engine didn't start, so we are still maintaining our best glide, and I'm going to start turning, and do one 10 degrees of flaps. We're still good. You're referring to this one, right? Yeah. Okay, with that little island over there. Okay. Maintain this one. And clock 7700 on our uh, transponder and declare emergency 121.5. Okay. Okay, then um, fuel shut off. We pull that fuel shut off. And we do 20 degrees of flaps. Uh, recover at 1,000 feet. 1,000, okay, 300 more. And then uh, seat belt, fuel shut off off. We, we pull that seat uh, belts uh, and harness. And flaps as needed, master and max off. We turn the max and master off. Okay. okay. Good. Okay, climb, positive climb, 75, back to 3000, maintain 330, okay, 3500, yeah. and we'll turn to the east, turn to the east, okay, yeah, well done, so we, we picked that field and we would have made that no problem, so, okay? And you started bringing the flaps in, okay? Okay. The only comment I have is just trying to work through that checklist a little faster, because yep. we are in an emergency situation, so we're pretty, we're getting close to our landing site and we're still doing checklist stuff, okay? Okay. But you're only exposed to it, you know, today, so um, really well done. Okay. Yes, sir. I'll practice this once I get home again. That's fine. What's the time? Uh, 22. There it is. Yep, let's keep climbing to 3,500. 3,500. And um, we'll turn to the south now. Turn to the south. Be right.
you can level out here. 3,000? Yep, okay. that's fine. 3,000. Close the engine. Yep. Okay. Best glide. Stop by stage traffic, 403 Gulf, Fox Trot. We're about two, well, four miles to the um, east of Grandview. We're descending from 3002 down to 2005. Okay, that's our best class, and now we're looking for a field. Okay, we have a field on our right. Identify it. I can't see anything. What else we got? Okay. Um. Um, we've already lost 500 feet. Okay. Um. We can take this uh, green green okay. patch, like all, all the way next all to right. the lake. We're a bit high to it, but we can we can turn. Watch that glide speed. Okay. All, all right. right. So we lost 700 feet. Let's keep going to that checklist. Okay, checklist. All right. So we have fuel shut off valve on. Make sure we okay. pull it out and look at it, verify it. Okay. Yep. And fuel on both. Okay. Put it what on what both. was it on before? It was on the right. Okay, now you're going fuel on both. All right, engine. Okay, fuel on both. Engine is restarted. Engine right. is restarted. Yep. Okay. And recover. There we go. Yep. So it can be just simple, something as simple as that. All right. Well. So that took us a long time just to figure that out. All right. We had already lost a thousand feet. Okay. Okay. So I appreciate you trying to pick that best field, but we got a, like we've got a lot of flat area out here. Okay, so we're going to try and speed that up. I don't want the, the most perfect field in the world. Okay. okay. Just something that's flat, no hazards, no power lines. Okay, and it's, it's going to be long enough for us to do an emergency landing. Okay, because by the time we figured out that we had just burnt out fuel in that right tank, we'd already lost a thousand feet. Okay. Okay. You'll maintain east? Yep. Okay, 3,000. Yeah, 3,000. 3,000, okay. Okay, now I'm starting to get it a little bit more. Okay. Yes, sir? Yeah, so I don't, I don't mind if you, yeah, just go through your flow off memory. That's fine, as long as you pull out that checklist and verify, okay? Because that's, you can easily miss, miss steps as well. Okay. Yeah, and that's what they want to see you as well, using that checklist. Okay. Sure. All right. So I don't mind if you, you know, go through that flow as long as you verify on the checklist. Okay. So I still have the checklist in my hand, but I, I can do it through memory? Um, yeah, if, if you've memorized the whole thing. Uh, okay. You can, you can do your flow. But always grab that checklist out and verify that you haven't missed anything. Yes, sir. Yeah? Yep. Because okay. obviously if you have it memorized, you're going to flow through it a lot faster. But always have to verify because it's very easy to miss steps. Okay. Or forget something. Got it. All right. East 3000. We got time for one more. Yes, sir. So let's pull that power. Okay. Establish this glide. As we're slowing down, we can also be looking for a field as well. Okay. Yeah, because we, time is critical. Okay. We have our our landing strip here, the one that we just okay. had. So that's an airport. All right. I'm gonna turn right. Yep. So I can make a down downwind. Yep. What else? So we made our our uh, landing. Okay. Let me trim to make sure I have it. Don't spend too long on it. Okay. We got other okay. stuff to get through. Then okay. Our fuel on board. Fuel shut off. Okay. And then uh, make sure best power. Yep. And then uh, we'll. Trying to learn this the right way. Okay, fuel selector, 
we did that auxiliary pump on, we did that. Oh, I, I cannot do it right now. Okay. And uh, make sure full reach, magnetos, check all, and master switch on. We still have a problem with the engine or not? Yep, no, the engine didn't restart. Engine didn't restart, so I... Uh, gonna put 10 degrees of flaps and try to save some altitude, because we went too far. Remember, bringing in flaps slows you down, because it creates more drag. Okay. All right. Let me see. Uh, I think I can still make that one. Yep. Okay, what else? Okay. Maintain base glide, squat 7700. Okay. And then we talk to the uh, controllers, 121.5. And fuel shut off, off, off. Turn that off. Make sure full reach. No, make sure full reach. No. Seat belts and harness. We have our seat and harness. And um, flaps as needed. Okay. Do 20. No. Uh, How's that airspeed? Fast. Yep. Uh, we we can we can do it with 10 degrees. Uh, recover here. Okay. Recover here. Okay, better, better distance control then. Just be mindful of your airspeed, okay? Yep, yep. Because, yeah, well, we're on a nice glide path then, but, but seeing a bit 80 knots, we're going to float a very long time, okay? If we get to that end of that field, if we timed it just right, that's going to be a very yep. long float. So uh, then we could I we could end up at the back of that runway. I got it, and I yeah. also went too far on the back doing all this checklist. Yeah. Crazy. There's a little bit to do, so but once we yeah. get comfortable yeah. going through it over and over, yeah. this this starts I speeding up it. quite, but no, you're doing well. Okay, let's start heading back to Grand Prairie. Grand Prairie, okay. Three, five, zero, three, six, zero. Let's see. Climb to 2,000? Yep. Okay, 2,000, and we see our See the Google building. Uh, there's a factory over there. Okay. So we're gonna aim to that. Yeah, 1,500 going to 2,000. Eagles. All right, 2,000, 2,200, going north. Now, 3,000 feet above us. Yeah, there's two around us, but a uh, lot higher. Yep. Okay. I think I didn't set up this correctly. Light ratio is... Oh, you put one, did you? Nine. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't know why it was so small. There, there we go. go. <laughs> 5,980 is a mile west of the 287 interchange, 2,000, headed back to Grand Prairie. Okay. Stop right there, Chuck. 283 miles to the southwest of San Juan Apache. Those are the Google buildings, right? Google. Yeah, that's what the uh, uh, what's 
her name? Joyce? Joyce, yeah. That's what she was referring when we came back. Ah, okay. That's our factory over there. The stacks. And that's the tip of the river. Are we going towards the... You know, Ooh, I'm aim for the tip. Be, I'm aim for the tip, okay. I see the towers over there. Okay, we're dropping 35502 is at 2000. One mile to the west of the Rock Quarry, northbound to Grand Parade. Three five. I was thinking we can we're gonna sink faster, but actually the the glide glide speed is very nice. Yeah, the light nice a lot uh, slower than I was imagining. The nice you get, you, get, you got plenty of time, don't you? Yeah. Yep, yep. I was thinking it's gonna be way faster going down. Uh, this bird wants to fly; it doesn't want to fall out of the sky, which is good. Awesome. Yeah. What else do we have to do heading to Grand Prairie? Okay, so we're going to start doing our descent, make sure, and we're going to listen to it. Fuel on mission, reach and fuel on both. And we do 80 centimeter in instruments. So let's do our 80s. 80 is 128. Oops. 118, 475. We have this one on COM2. Just approaching, use land in the parting runway 175, Mr. Clint, like that, I think Mason Tango. Mason Tango, 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 Mason Time information Tango, time 1750, wind 13010, track it is better than 5005. 13010. Stop right there, traffic 7 28 kilo, kilo robot, sound of the low, can headed back to the ground. 13010. Okay, temperature 2617, and altimeter 300. That's our 300 altimeter. Okay. And instruments, also we switch to tower. So Press it. The screen. Okay. And uh, the top one, top one. There you go. Okay, 12855. 12855, that's one. Okay, we are almost at a tip, so we're going to give them a call once we are over the Water. Five here, five there, left turn. Yeah. Left turn, that's five, five, five. You can see Grand Prairie Tower. There's now three five five zero two. Um, ten miles to the south. Oh, Inbound full there, stop with right information right, 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 zero. Again, your so tango. Yep. Tango. 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 And uh, northwest to the stadium. Cherokee one seven seven. Roger, right turn out to the stadium. Where's the traffic? Uh, he's out here to the right. He's out here to the right. He's fine. Okay. We'll uh, proceed direct to the left down on the port 20, 5 Okay, after the call, I'm going to do the pre-landing. Okay. Number Let me know what. Number 2, 8 kilo kilo is about 10 nautical miles so east of the Jopo Lake. He's bound for a full stop with information back up. Seven two one eight kilo kilo, Grand Prairie, good afternoon. Report to Dan for left downwind, and you can squawk 0411. Zero four four one and report the name. Send out two one eight kilo kilo. Oh, they're off to our right. You can give me a call now. Two one eight kilo kilo. Just uh, emphasize it. Zero four one one. Zero four one one. Sorry about that. Two one kilo kilo. Yep. Okay. Okay. 
Jumper Tower, Cessna 35502, 10 miles to the south, inbound, full stop, with the information tango. It's 35502, good afternoon, Squawk 0450, and proceed towards the dam. Are you 1900 right now? 0450, 35502, I'm at 1900, yes. Just free seat to the dam. Okay. There's 5298 Sierra, number one, clear to land, runway 17. Number one, clear to land, runway 17, 5298 Sierra. There's 35502, just past oh, the supposed to say mile altitude. east of the marina, and you can proceed for left down. Pass a mile east to the marina, for left downwind. Pass a mile east to the marina, uh, enter left downwind, 35502. Yeah. Okay, so is that on order? Yeah, so that's the marina, so we just want to be to the right. Okay. Because we've got seminal traffic, they're going to the dam. Okay. The Sports okay. 3 Gulf Fox, Grand Prairie Tower, maintain a VFR. Practice approach proved, no separation service divided. Report the final approach fix at Squawk 0420. Landing light on. Autopilot off. Seat belt. All good. Make sure best power. Fuel on both. Fuel on both. And flat pass. Flat pass required. A one mile right to the marina. And enter. Once we cross the marina, then we are descending to 1,400, right? Yep, after we yeah, pass this lake. Okay. Yeah, just come over to the right a little bit more. Yes, sir. We can start lining up for our downwind. Okay. Just inside that road that's going north. Okay. Number 218, Kilo Kilo, you're going to be following Cessna traffic uh, just off to your left there about your uh, 10 o'clock now and maybe a mile and a half. Report that traffic. Report that traffic, Cessna 218, Kilo Kilo. I hope he sees us. Yeah, I've got him. Enter directly yeah, on the so downwind, right? Yeah, so we just so keep going straight. Go over between Good those two. Six. So we can start, we can start descending now. Good afternoon. We're well, basically just going flying straight, straight ahead. Drive yes, sir. Four care flight six. I'm at south tip of Joe's Pool Lake inbound for care flight ramp. Care flight six, four one seven, Charlie Fox, whatever you'd like to call yourself today, that's fine, sir, and report the dam for me. <laughs> We'll go with Care Flight 6 then. Care Flight 6 is the winner. Kilo Kilo, we're over the down. We have the traffic inside. 28 Kilo Kilo, Roger, you're going to be number 3 following that, Seth. Number 3 following him, Kilo Kilo. Grand Prairie Tower, Aztec 6 liner 448. Once we get midfield, just let them know where we are. Yes, sir. Uh, reporting six, six, midfield, and they'll give us a clearance to land. Hold short, runway okay. 17, landing truck. Only short one seven six nine or four four Yankee. This three five five zero two report midfield left down. Report midfield left down wind three four four zero two. Five five. Three five five. Three five five zero two. Fox report the final perfect. I'm struggling with that call sign today. Or do you wish to <laughs> this I think you've given it six uh, different numbers. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me. Four zero three Gulf Fox, Roger. Report entering a left down one. You're going to be following a seminal about your water. That's fox. because I'm looking at the. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, um, trying to make you happy. Left down one for one seven. We'll look for the traffic. Four zero three Gulf. So many things to do. There is. All right, what's that? Five two nine eight zero. Left the Delta taxi to park. Monitor the ground. Left the Delta taxi to park. Monitor the ground. Five two nine zero. Thank you. Ooh, lucky. S6 6944 Yankee, Grim for Terror, runway 17, clear for takeoff, south departure. Clear for takeoff, south departure, 6944 Yankee. Grim Prairie Tower, Cessna 35502 reporting midfield. This 
35502, Roger, Department 1, priority arrival, number 1, clear to land. Clear to land, number 1, 35502. Okay. It's 402, four Gulf three. Fox, and if you could give me the best speed you can. Uh, I'm full power before flaps. Or before flaps. Uh, we're going to do the best speed and report the... Uh, okay, uh, aiming uh, for 85. 17402, Gulf Fox. Uh, 1500. Okay, right over here. And Brett Robert, this is 2479 Mike. Uh, we are 10 miles southeast of the airport. Nobody on final. Nobody on final. Okay, it's 2479 Mike, Grand Prix Tower maintained via far approach. No separation service provided. Report the final approach. We'll report the final approach, 2479 Mike. Watch that airspeed. Nose down. Grand Prairie Tower, King Air 149 Charlie Fox, uh, inbound landing with Tango, about three and a half miles south. King Air 149 Charlie Fox, ride report midfield left down, you're going to be following Cessna traffic currently at 12 o'clock and two miles. They're doing 120. Not Charlie Fox. Uh, I think I have the traffic inside, and uh, we'll call midfield left downwind. SX 6944 Yankee traffic just ahead to your left. 30 degrees of flat. Yep, so you're going to be doing crosswind. 6944 Yankee. Okay. 50. Good. Ground Prairie Tower, 403 Gold Fox Road, report yeah, midfield left downwind. Yeah, we're thinking that's fine. We're nearly there. 403 Gold Fox Roger, number two now, clear left. Okay. Number two, clear to land. I'm bringing out that airspeed. Air flight six, traffic just ahead to your left, about 11 o'clock at two miles southbound of Aztec. No, 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 no. I'm looking for that traffic here, flight six. He kept that airspeed in, that throttle, and he didn't bring back that nose, okay? That's two why we landed so flat. Keep your speed up, left the Delta Taxi Park Monitor Ground. Left the Delta Taxi Park Monitor Ground, 35502. Okay. This is 2479 Mike, Grand Prix Tower, we're enabled, Squawk 0434. Okay. Squawk 0434, 2479 Mike. We did that. Grand Prix Tower, 9 Charlie Fox, has been filled down with. Yeah, 9 Charlie Fox, number 2 now, found SS traffic there on our base, number 2. Okay, Pito D, half, mixer, best 4, and 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 4, Okay, strobes, time, and break rate. <laughs> you were reading pre takeoff oh, after. Kilo, 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 that's all right, that's good. Delta yeah, okay, so Make sure you're reading front. the right one. Yep. Kilo, kilo. After landing. Let's do five. Grab your flight six center and left down. Landing lights off, uh, strobes off. Uh, you could uh, plan on yep. taxiway alpha on the uh, east side. I'll let you know here in a minute. Copy right, that, yeah, care flight six. This is 247 Mike, traffic heading to your left about 11 o'clock now, southbound 2004. Traffic on this one? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Alright, stop there. Don't get too close to that rope. Okay. Securing. Make sure I read the... Okay. Avionics off. Uh, 